Okay, so, um, today I'm going to be showing you guys an interesting video I found on YouTube. It was one of my favorite YouTube people to watch, I Talk Apple. Um, she's really, really a lot better than I am at making videos, but that's, that's not the point. Um, I found her Docker video, or, anyways, okay. So it's this thing called Docker, if you'll see right here. And I really like it because um, I got this sick Monster Energy dock that I found. And I wanted to share this with you guys. So please, all credit goes to her for, find, for making the video about this and showing it to everybody. So this is all... Give the credit to her. She's I Talk Apple, please. So yeah, and um, I'll have these in the description. So yeah, you're just gonna click on the link and hit download now, and then it should go to your downloads or wherever you have uh, your downloads saved to. Then you can exit out of that once it once it's done downloading. Drag it out, install it, and yeah. Go to apps, drag it, you know, whatever. Now, then you can either open up Docker and pick something yourself or do a custom image, which you have to download the file. So, yeah. Um, I just used the Monster Energy one. You can actually go from 3D to 2D dock. Um so there's no reflection or anything but I prefer to keep it 3D um you can do translucent icons so the applications will have translucent a translucent appearance when they're hidden so you can remember which one is hidden and which ones aren't uh, indicator style which I believe is the little glowy dots thingies um, separator style, like a separator, but, yeah, anyways, uh, 2D dock outline, only for the 2D dock, if you need that, 3D dock, you can do default, uh, no reflection, custom color, plain, with plain no, no background, or custom, um, like as in custom images, and you can select a color if you do one of the colors, but, uh, select folder for that. Okay, so that's about that. So settings, you can change the icon sizes, magnified icon sizes when you have magnification on. Um, position, um, you can do that in the. You don't have to have Docker to change the position, but yeah, you can do bottom, middle. You can do left start or end so yeah it's it's pretty interesting like if i did left start apply and oh that's stupid okay well there we go so now it is in the left start but i don't like that so bottom middle apply Okay, and it does get rid of your thing. So the default image was restored, but I'm going to undo that. So I didn't know it would do that, but whatever. So I'm going to go to my trash because I believe that's where it is. Okay, so monster energy. Exit, okay. Sorry, I like it. I don't know why. Okay, so styles and colors, select folder, monster energy, select, apply. And it will ask you for your computer thing, password, but, you know, whatever. Alright, so there, there, I have it back. Uh, stacks and spacers, you can add those if you want. Kiosk settings, uh, you can hide the dock, hide dock and menu bar, which the menu bar is right here. Uh, remove dock, remove dock, and menu bar. So they will be removed, but you can always change that. So... Menu bar visibility. You can select the application you want visible, which I don't need to do. Settings locks. Uh, you can change that. 
if you want, like lock magnification, lock size, all that stuff. Docker, that's just about it. You can donate if you want. You don't have to. And then, yeah, you can close and it'll quit the application. So, yep. Um, all links will be in description. And I believe as well as the wallpaper. So, thanks for watching and I'll see you guys around later. Um, bye.